Okay, queens, before we get started with a great reveal, this is the corn roll pattern that I had for this hair. Now, you'll also see in this shot, my assistant is taking down the hair that I had in for about three, maybe three, three and a half weeks, I want to say. So she's going to go ahead and take that down. So you see how much new growth I have within that time period? Let me tell you what I have done with this installation. Ms. PK's Ms. PK's Crochet Braids located here in McDonough, Georgia. So let's get straight to this new hair reveal review. So you guys saw my head size and you also saw me, well, having somebody take down the hair. So I want you guys to see that so you can see that growth going on in the hair and also, I am not taking down the corn roll because I've only had those corn rolls in for about three and a half weeks, maybe going on four, but I'll say three and a half. So guess what, you guys? You can do another installation on top of those corn rolls because they're not that old. Normally, a crochet braid installation will last you six weeks some women like to keep it in for four and some women keep it in for six. And unfortunately, some women take it too far and go eight to nine. And eh, eh, eh. you're not supposed to do that because you want to take your hair down and get to that scalp. So this is a new installation on my old corn rolls. Now, if you guys have oily hair and you don't want to put another new installation on your old, old corn rolls what you can do is just go ahead and wash the corn rolls wash your scalp really good let it air dry and then put your installation in if you have really dry scalp um really bad dandruff then you know you may not want to do that but if you're okay with the way your scalp is looking and it's not smelling it's not itchy it's not flaky you can actually do another corn roll installation on top of those old corn rolls. So this is what I did. Because I'm doing so many videos now, I want to bring you guys some freshness uh, when it comes to these new hair um, reveal videos at least every three weeks. So in order to do that, I cannot leave my install in for six weeks, even though I want to, but I can't do that. So you can recycle those corn rolls and do another great installation on top of your old corn rolls. Okay, queens, y'all tell me what you think. Tell me what you think <laughs> about that. And if you guys have not seen um, Priscilla Shriver's um, hair video, you guys go and watch that because everything, most of, most of the things that she says on her video regarding hair health is what I stand by. So, for instance, you don't have to wash your hair every uh, week. You don't have to do that. If your hair is not needing to be washed, then just let it be. Because once you let your hair be, that's when you'll see some growth. You know, and there's other things that go along with it, like um, eating right, um, keeping yourself hydrated, keeping your hair hydrated, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. We'll get into all that in another video. But I wanted to let you guys know that you don't have to take down your old, old corn rolls. Now, they are going to be loose. So you just take the new installation and you just wrap two corn rolls together because they're going to be super loose. Wrap two corn rolls together instead of doing one on one roll. Just do two. You know, and there you have it. Okay. So are you guys ready for this new hair installation reveal review? Okay. Oh, one more thing. I am happy to announce that I will be going mobile. PK is going mobile. And that's going to start the second week in October. So I will be going mobile. I will be going only an hour out. That's it. No further. Only an hour out to see you. So Queens, you can go ahead and book that mobile um, crochet braid on style c and it's going to be um every friday so every friday i will be going out 
mobile and doing at least three to four clients on Fridays. And that's only for you folks in Georgia. Sorry, Queens. This is only my Georgia Queens for right now. So, you know, and you have to be a current client. I am not doing this for new clients and I'm not doing it for the alopecia clients. Alopecia clients, you queens, you have to come in um, during the weekday, the afternoon, Wednesday, Thursday afternoon, or on Saturdays. So, but I'm super excited to get out there and come to you guys on Friday. So just, if you're interested in that, just go to Style Seat. You'll see Miss um, PK's Crochet Braid Mobile. And that's where you wanna book your appointment. And then I will give you a call and we'll work out all the arrangements. So I'm super excited about that. That is happening this month. All right, queens, here we go for the new hair reveal. Let me get up close, hold on. Pretty to get up close so y'all can see. Somebody think they cute. Somebody think they cute. All right, ladies. Here you go. Here you go. All right. All right, Link Queens. I like this hair. I really do like it. And this is, I'll tell you what this is, you guys. Isn't that pretty? That is so pretty. Oh my goodness, that's so pretty. But in, in about, uh, probably like a week and a half, I'm only gonna weave this in for another probably three weeks, but I'm gonna cut this. <laughs> I'm gonna wear it like this. Normally what I do is I'll wear an installation like this when it's long like this, I'll wear it for like, now if I was keeping this in for six weeks, the third week, I would go ahead and start cutting and trimming and shaping this up into another look to give me a different look for the next three weeks. But since I'm only keeping this in for about two weeks, maybe two and a half, I'm going to cut it. And if you guys want me to come on here and show you just how I cut it, because I can already see, you know, I, I just have the eyes to see where I'm going to cut it and how I'm going to cut it. Um, let me know and I'll cut it. On here, I'll just do maybe a short, a YouTube short, and then cut it on here um, so you guys can see just a simple cut. All right, so this is what the hair is. Hold on. Oh, Lord. <laughs> All right, Queens, this is what the hair is. And now, I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, but I think it's Madi or, or Madi. Madi. Okay, so this is the Bohemian Box Braids 12 inch. Okay, three times, you see that? Bohemian Box Braid 12 inch, that's what this is, okay? All right, now you guys, can you guys see that price up there? It says $10.99, so let's just say $11, $11, and it says three times. Okay, I'm always kind of leery about when it says three times. So I did my little homework. Now, this is made a beauty braid three times, Bohemian box braid, 12 inch. They did also have it in um, an 18, 20 inch as well, which is really pretty, but I didn't want it to have it that long. Um, it is pretty though, it's very pretty. But you guys, um, check this out. Let me show you something, okay. Is this not the same hair? This is a very popular brand that I always use. The clients come in, they want wanting this. The Free Trust Boho Hippie Braid 12 inch, okay? Look at that, you guys. 12 inch, matter of fact, it's coming out the package, okay? So this is the 12 inch, okay? It looks just like this hair. Let me take it all the way out. Okay, 
it doesn't it look just like this hair it's it's the same thing the same thing okay now you guys check this out same thing so boho hippie braid um 12 inch this is one pack so normally when i tell you guys to get a pack of hair for this hair you want to get seven seven packs and that way it ensures that you have enough hair for the installation okay you get seven packs but this hair says three times okay so this is about 1.5 packs of hair of this right here so you're getting 1.5 you're not getting three times because you put three of these together that's three times one two three this is not this is not three times this is 1.5 and so for this hair you will need five packs for a medium sized head or a large head or a small, small head, maybe four. But for a medium to large hair, five packs would do you because you'll have leftover hair, okay? This pack, you'll need seven, seven packs, okay? Now, this pack is $11, um, five packs around $55 or so. This pack, seven packs, around 60, 65, $63, something like that, okay? So, I recommend you get this pack. Um, two reasons, because you'll save money and it's a better quality of hair. Yes, this these are the same exact hair. This, I'm sorry, free dress, I love my free dress, I really do. But in this case, this hair is higher quality. You know, and then you are paying $11, but it's still cheaper to getting this and better quality than getting this and paying a few more dollars. I, I like this hair. It's still, it's still nice, but this hair is better. Sorry, free dress. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> but, you know, hey, if you need to pick this up, you know, like a pack, you know, you want to just add to something, you know. It, it's good, but this this is better. This is better. The same hair, but better. All right, queen. So I just want to let you guys um, see that discovery that I made. Wow. But I am loving this hair. And this is cuttable hair. So you guys want to cut it. It's cuttable hair. And I say that because if you cut it, it still leaves... Um, a lot of this pretty curl pattern now this is the one this is the reason why i chose this because i love this curl pattern i love that look in that pretty that is so pretty i love that curl pattern now i will suggest and say that um you guys you've seen the curl, corn roll pattern for this hair now i wouldn't do this corn roll pattern for this because there's no versatility with this um i can't flip it to the left or the right or I can probably pull it, you know, and do a little ponytail or something like that. But um, I can't, I can't do anything more with it really. Besides, uh oh, my earring fell out. Besides, just let it hang. And um, so I would suggest that you get the um, box braid pattern in the front and the back, and do your middle for the beehive. Or if you someone wants to do the whole head box braids, that's great. That's great. And then. Um, then you lose use less hair too that way, but it'll give the illusion of it looking like you have individual single braids. So, and this would play well with that look. Um, but you know, unfortunately, I just had the same corn roll pattern. And also, let me show you guys. So I have a piece of hair. Okay, you guys see this hair right here? I'm trying to save you guys money. For you queens that are on a budget, this is this is what you want to do. If you're on a budget, you know, see this hair? It's a box braid. See that? It's box braid all the way up to here to there. Okay, so what you can do, queens, if you're on a budget and it's real tight, because these days it's inflation and it, everything is just going up, up, up you can actually recycle this hair only if it comes like this now if you have not um you know lost the curl pattern here 
and you haven't been doing too much with this hair and you love the hair, you know, instead of cutting it, cutting it like we did, like, like you saw previously, cutting it um, above the knot and flipping it out, don't cut it. Just sit there and take them out individually, okay? If you're on a budget and, and you want to, you know, recycle this hair, because hair is expensive. It really is. All kinds of hair is expensive. You can take that, take some time sitting in front of the TV or doing whatever and take them out and then go ahead and gingerly wash them with some shampoo, um, leave-in conditioner, and apple cider vinegar. And go ahead and do that. Then you guys go ahead and let them air dry and just recycle and put them, put them back in. You know, take the corn rolls down, you know, because by then it'll be time to take your corn rolls down, wash your hair, shampoo it, hydrate it, and then go ahead and get it rebraided and and put your um put your hair back in. You know, I had um, a client and um, she was a single mom and she's a school teacher. And, you know, our teachers don't make enough money, do not make enough money at all. I have principals, assistant principals, a lot of teachers, and the teachers don't make a lot of money. So this is one of the suggestions I, I told her and um, she did it and came back and we did her daughter's hair one more time. So, you know, if you have the time and you want to do that and you want to save, you know, um, $60, then you can go ahead and do that. So that's just a little tip that I'm giving you queens. So um, a budget tip, some kind of way to save some money these days. All right, queens, I think that is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed the video because I enjoy making these videos. And you guys stay tuned for the B-roll and be blessed. And stay out of, stay out of mess. <laughs> Please stay out of mess and stay safe. Be blessed, y'all.